25 News at 5. Governor Granholm says wind will power mid-Michigan forward. But we'll show you how for at least one company dealing in wind nearly put it out of business. But first, I'll create thousands of jobs in Michigan. But today, NBC 25's Dave Laval talked with one local business owner in the business who says it might not work. New boats are being built at Gujon Brothers in Bay City. Building things is something that has taken place here since the company was created nearly 40 years ago. And not just for the water. Wind has played a big part in the company's history since Mead Gujon and his brother built their first ice boat. The sailors, you're always uh, fascinated by the use of wind. That carried over in 1977 when Gujon Brothers received a grant for NASA to build wind blades. That led to the construction of a plant in Pinconning. 75 employees were responsible for making 26 blades a day that were used in wind power equipment around the world and the U.S. We built over 4,600 blades and we never had a failure. But the industry did a few years later, especially in the U.S., as most companies went bankrupt. Gujon Brothers almost became a victim. It was a, uh, I like to say, a three and a half million dollar lesson in risk management that this company just barely survived. The blade stopped spinning for the Gujon Brothers in 1987, but that does not mean they got out of the wind business. Employees primarily now make epoxy resins. They're used to help bond a variety of manufactured materials, many of which are used to generate power from the wind. Even though Michigan's governor wants more wind energy in our state, the Gujon brothers are not yet ready to provide it. In Bay City, Dave Laval, NBC 25 News. Owners tell NBC 25 95% of the industry is controlled by European companies. 